the, the, the vehicle we are using clonidine that is the tablet the mucosa tablet this uh, is a tablet that has uh, stick into, into the mucosa and, and we know well that it st stays for six hours and in these six hours there is a release of the of the agent and it case clonidine and uh, we, the second important issue is that clonidine uh, we know for years that it was a hypertensive uh, agent but we know that it has a lot of uh, anti-inflammatory uh, efficacies and it, 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 the 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 it was, has been well established so this is rational to to conduct this this trial and and, and in this trial we we, we perform a, a phase two randomized trial so uh, there is a, a, a placebo arm uh, eligible patients were patients treated with surgery and post-operative chemo radiotherapy and, uh, and uh, the primary endpoint was the the, the incidence to the, the, of uh, the primary input was to show that mucos uh, clonidine could decrease the the incidence the rate of oral mucositis so uh, uh, this randomized uh, double blind phase two trial was, was established in three arms, one arm uh, patient had placebo and in the two arm two different doses, 50 micrograms and, 10 and 100 micrograms. So uh, the design was very clean and, and the data uh, we, we, we are presenting today is, is that, that the clonidine reduces the incidence of mucositis from 60 to 40 percent and also the 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 onset the time onset from um, uh, the the apparition of grade three mucositis is uh, on the on the 30 35 there so there is a 10 day delay on the apparition and also the doses for the patients